Howdy, Mark Serbu, gun designer, gun nut. Trying out a new thing here, Friday Desk Pop. It's kind of a risky thing, and uh, I probably won't try to monetize this, because, you know. So here we go. Uh, well, first off, I bought this recently. It's the uh, Ruger 5.7 pistol, and uh, it's cool. I like it. It's, I've always liked the FN 5.7. But, you know, it's expensive as hell. This thing's like half the price, and it's it's pretty nicely made, and it's accurate, and shoots this great, great little bullet. The 5.7, I think it's a great little round. Um, anyway, see how it shoots from the desk. Alrighty, here we go. I'm shooting for the alien's face. I'm going for his... Uh, his left eye, it's to my right, so we'll see how this goes. Uh, I can't tell where that hit. Let's try again. Alright. Ah, that ceiling's coming down a little bit. Alright, it's not a real group unless it's five shots, right? Took the mag out for the last shot. Alright, clear. See what we got here. Let's bring this puppy up. Yeah, there's kind of looking at me. Ah, okay, well, not super great. One, two, three, four, and uh, I guess that's the fifth one because those two are from last time. Those two plus that are from last time. This is from an accident. You know how it goes. Anyway, great. Got my little GoPro going here, too. So hopefully uh, you like that and it doesn't make you unsubscribe because I'm a maniac. Uh, seriously, this is a it's a really cool bullet trap I got a while back. And I bought it because I was looking for something that was portable. I mean, it, it is portable, but holy crap, this thing, it's got to weigh 50 pounds, of course, because it's got armor plate in it and it's full of, you know, shredded up uh, like conveyor belt stuff. But I was looking for something that I could transport around the shop because I just, you know, I've got that giant bullet trap. It's just, you know, it weighs a ton. This thing, you know, 50 pounds isn't too bad. And uh, it's convenient. But I thought, you know what? I can shoot in my office with this. It, it can take up to 308, uh, which is freaking amazing. And uh, I actually bought it just, you know, sight unseen. Then I contacted the company and said, hey, how about if I advertise this on my channel? You guys, you know, give me a, a break on it, and uh, so yeah, I've got a I've got a discount code that I've got in the description of the video, and you can get twenty five bucks off. Yeah, pretty neat little little units. Uh, if you've got a little shop, a little gunsmith operation, this thing's like four hundred bucks, and uh, you know, up to three hundred eight. What the hell? Awesome little unit. Uh. Yeah, this uh, this Friday desk pop thing, it's <laughs> it is not going to be a series. <laughs> I was just kidding. Um, yeah, this is really really dangerous. There's nobody here at the shop while I'm doing this. I take a lot of precautions downrange. Uh, as I said in the description at the beginning and in the text in the beginning, don't try this at home. Uh, you know, if there's someone around, or even if there's a pet around, someone comes running in here, that thing's down low, and boom! Oh my God, just yeah, extremely dangerous. Make sure. Well, Make sure you don't do it. And I'm not just kidding. Uh, this is really, really, really dangerous. But that bullet trap is first rate. It's got no problem stopping, like I said, up to 308. Fantastic little product there. Uh, and this isn't something I do on a regular basis, but it is, it's kind of cool to be, able, to be able to do it, to be in a country and in a state where you're allowed to do this kind of thing. That's, that's pretty cool. Um, and Hopefully that's the main thing I'm just trying to put across here, aside from showing you the, the neat little bullet trap that I've got in my office. Anyway, thanks for watching, appreciate you, and I will catch you next time.